Galaxi has evidently become the most underrated featured server on Minecraft Bedrock Edition. With low player counts and such a well put together server, Galaxi is yet to get the recognition they deserve. But what exactly is the future of this featured server, and why exactly do they have such massive potential? Interested? Let's get started. Although Galaxi has many of the same features and game modes as the other featured servers, the twist this server puts on each of the two things mentioned makes it stand out. This ranging from their custom UI designs all the way to their original game mode ideas. But what exactly about these features make their server stand out in the eyes of the public? And why do these features present such great potential for Galaxi? For starters, let's look at their custom UI. The way the friends menu and even the game selector are set up, in a futuristic sense, is smart and as well as this, very pleasing to the eye. By this I mean when you click the likes of the friends menu, the way it's set up to show you your friend's name, as well as the Galaxi costume they're wearing, assuming they're wearing one, is very original. As well as this, rather than how the Hive and Cubecraft have it where you scroll through a list of names, Galaxi has set up where there are several rows of names so it's easier and more simplistic to navigate through. But the way they set up their UI is not the only original idea that they have. They also have a sense of originality through the way they they have achievements, their game ideas and the way they add a twist to already existing games. With the achievement aspect, this is something we have never seen on any of the other featured servers. It was a very original and big brain move from Galaxi, which also rewards the player for completing them. As for the original game ideas, they have games such as Chronos and Hyper Racers, and then for the twist they put on already existing games such as Rush and Planets, means this server has crazy originality. The reason this means that they have such massive potential however, is due to the fact they stand out. This is a featured server promoted by Microsoft which isn't paid to play and despite the low player counts is on par with the likes of The Hive and Cubecraft. The only difference being is although the two servers mentioned are different in their own ways, they roughly follow the same path, whereas Galaxite doesn't follow that path and stands out due to it. Updates are a key part to the success of any server. These are what keep people hooked and attract new players. This is also something some of the servers with larger player counts have been struggling to be consistent with. However, Galaxi is very different when it comes to the likes of updates. Just like how Fortnite has seasons where we see a new update every season, this is the same for Galaxi. Yes, they roll out new shop changes and bug fixes every Thursday, but a new game comes out every season, and we're only on season four at this current time. So Galaxi Galaxi don't leave their players waiting with no notice or give their players the opportunity to find the server stale since they're always making changes and rolling out updates. And as well as this, when they say they are going to release something, they see it through and release that update, instead of consistently giving their player base false hope on a daily basis. This is a key part of their huge potential because new players will eventually catch on that this server does indeed release updates. And as well as this, we'll know to expect a new game every season and to see their favourite career creators make a video regarding that season. And with the ability to attract new players as well as keep new players hooked, it slowly leads to their player count growing and the server finally getting the recognition it deserves. Now I'm not saying the other servers don't interact with their community because they very much do, however Galaxite's interactivity is on a whole other level. A key piece of evidence to express this is the fact that Galaxite has now started to sponsor creators videos. And no, before you think this is an alley-oop to say this video is sponsored, it isn't. The most recent sponsored video is Potato Pie 25s regarding Galaxite Chronos. And I'm not saying that servers should sponsor their creators to make videos, and Galaxite is definitely not doing it for that reason. However, it's a nice way for the server to support their partner ranks who are making a video on their server. This is something we have never seen any of the big servers even think about doing for their partners. So this is just a really nice way for Galaxite to support their creators out of the many ways they already have. As well as this, Galaxite is hosting a tournament the week of this video being released, titled Summer Blast Tournament 2021. There are 32 creators taking part, including myself, with the chance to win $1,000. This is being hosted by the server itself and all the funds to the winners are paid by Galaxite. Once again, a completely original idea and a great way to interact with the community while making history. Yes, we've seen other tournaments hosted on the likes of The Hive 
However, this is the first time the actual server itself is setting it all up and providing the winnings. The reason this shows such great potential for Galaxite is because if all goes well, we could see even bigger and better Don tournaments in the future. And since Potato Pie 25 sponsorship video went so well, we can see even more Galaxite partners being sponsored in the future too. And just the way the Galaxite staff interact with the player base through the Discord and the server just shows they care so much. And you can't possibly dislike the server in any way, shape or form. So yes, this is why we can expect a very bright future from Galaxite and why exactly the server has such great potential. And although they're getting low player counts right now, with some of the ideas for updates and future games they have in mind, we can expect some very big changes to this already amazing server. And I would just like to say that all the information provided in this video for their potential is solely based on what they already have done with the server and what we already know. So due to that, I couldn't really predict or say what they have in mind, but instead base their potential on what they have already done. Thank you all for watching, stay safe and bye.